Okay, here's the door. We need to put fire. Now uh, there's the steel. Where's the firewood? Is that it? Yeah. Put the firewood in the steel. It sounds as though the hooch is destilling de nicely now. You gain 100 experience points for refueling the steel. So he wasn't kidding. That's an easy job. Just run out of here, and we get 50 dollars. Nice and easy. I'll think I'll kick him. And I miss. We're not going to be leveling up anytime soon. Maybe if we can do some of these little quests in this town, we level up, get enough money to buy uh, armor, and then we can go to the toxic cave. But thanks for refueling my steel for me. Here's your 52. Got any questions that I can answer for you? What's going on in the town lately? All sorts of things going on hereabouts lately. We've got Brahmin mutilators, walking spirits, gigantic rats, and missing people. Some even say the dens involved. Yeah. Let's go one by one. Brahmin mutilations. They say that creatures that look like giant man shaped barks in a shell and everything are mutilating Brahmin at night. All they find are torn open, horrible, hacked up Brahmin corpses. Yeah, that sounds pretty par horrible. A few people have seen the Bugman, but the one who's got the best look was Thor, the Buckner's boy. But he so scared him uh, half out of his wits, and the poor lad is a bit shy on in that part department already. Okay, let's something else about walking spirit. There's a canyon just to the west of town that had a bright light in it a few months back. Ever since every now and then, there's been a horrible squealing sound that comes from the canyon. Problem that wander in don't come out back. Everyone's afraid to get too near. Yes, surely a, a sign of spirit infestation. If only you had a competent shaman. Tell me something else. Gigantic rats. I've got to hear more about those. Well, out back of Trapper Town, just to the west of downtown, there's a back section that's overrun by rats. The further back you go, the bigger they get. Some say that there's one huge great rat spirit that's leading them all. Some of the trappers won't even stay there anymore. They say it's too dangerous. Yeah. Trappers... Uh, tell me something else. Missing people. Yeah, I think that's the... Smiling. Oh no. Lately we've had a couple of people called missing. A trader, Vic, who specializes in people stuff, and one of our best trappers. Yeah, the smiling. Tell me about Vickle. Vic, Vic, Vic. Well, Vic was kind of quite a fella. He didn't like to work too much, so he would specialize in expensive pre war things and then go sell them to the den or even haul them to stupid tribals as religious artifacts. Ah, uh, chuckles to himself. Oops, no offense. Anyhow, I haven't seen him for a while. Last I heard, he went south to sell some stuff. Maybe to the den. Okay, tell me about the den. Can we... Yeah, I'm not gonna ask about the gig. Not a den. THE den. You'll not find a greater hive of scum and villainy. Now, where did I hear that? In any case, it's a rough sort of place a few days travel south of Lama. Anything can be had there for a price, even slaves. But you have to be very careful there. Lots of short tempers, attacks to dangerous weapons. I don't think they have much to do with us, though. We're too... We're too poor here. Yeah, I think that's all. We now have a decent understanding of what's going on here. So... We have Brahmin mutilations with Tor, evil spirits, gigantic rats, and missing people. 
so I'll, I'll okay what's this it's green okay This robot has sustained a great deal of damage. Its surface is covered with thin scratches, mud, and broken wires. Okay. Is this the evil spirit? Nanu Nanu. Uh, funny. And that's probably one of the reasons uh, this kind of stuff that someone might not like this game. Because there's this kind of culture, pop culture references and jokes is everywhere. So they might be a bit overwhelming to some people who want their post apocalyptic role playing games to be serious. You might not be able to enjoy it fully if you're constantly reminded of that you're just playing a game. Electronics yellow reactor keycard. Okay, why does a birdie bird has one? I don't think we can get anything of actual value here. Besides that keycard. We're going to have to take out that robot though. I think that shouldn't be a problem. The reason is quite simple. I noticed it just moving a I think two two hexes at a time. So and since we can move ten that means we can cause damage and retreat and he'll never get to attack us. Yeah, he moves three. He does. Okay, almost dead. Crippled glimpses. Okay, that was stupid. I, not really. As long as I think I move a single square, he can't attack me. Okay, that wasn't true. Jesus Christ. He can actually attack pretty hard. Okay, that's what happens when you get careless. I can't loot it. But I at least get 200 experience points. That's quite a bit. But totally I got wounded unnecessarily. Mm. So what's this then? If I enter Trapper Town. I'll use a uh, healing powder. Tell, try to talk to someone in Trapper Town. Yeah, no one's talking to me. There has to be something of interest here. Well, we do, do have the key, so probably we can get to a locked area in here. No, I don't like kids. Can I use it here? No. Where is the trapper? key then. Do you have kids? No, I don't have kids. I'm not married. One, two, three, we... And I've been here. Is 
Is that a door? Yeah, it's hard to say with this lighting what's what. Okay, hello there friend. Nice to you nice of you to visit all of us here. My name's Slim Picket. Slim Picket. I I talk for Trapper Town, so you're some kind of representative. Do you have anything to trade? Uh Trapper Town key, we already have one, so guess there are many ways to get it. Yeah, give us your money. Hello there, Slim. My name's Ophelia. Why do you call this Trapper Town? Well, this here part of town is where all of us trappers live when we were not out trapping geckos. Only problem out the three digs are the rats on the north side. But we have most of the entrances to that part of the wall barricaded pretty good. Tell me about trapping geckos. Maybe I could get tips to fighting them. You're interested in trapping, huh? He looks you up and down. I don't think I'd try it if I were you. You might get your hands dirty and calloused. <laughs> Anything else you want to know about? Well, I don't appreciate that. Seems to imply I'm afraid to get my hands dirty and do work. Proper physical labor, as I am quite a physical lady. Strength and endurance very high. I sure wish I was as skilled trapper as you are. I bet you'd teach me a lot. Let's let's like to butter him up a bit. Your tribe are mostly farmers, aren't they? I don't think I could teach you a darn thing. Although my speech is crap and courage must crap, so this will likely never work. I'm already that good, how huh? Well, tell me about something else then. Rats, tell me about the rats. Well, the taste would be pretty good if you speed roast them with just a teach of herbs. But most of the time they can be a real nuisance and they're getting worse. We've barricaded the north side of town, but they're sneaking through anyway. There's one door to the north side right here, but I have it locked. At home, mom just used to pan fry them with a little butter. But tell me more about the rat attacks. People been disappearing. Just them as are slow and sickly for now. Cause they don't stop to cook their food like us. They just gnaw it into a few bloody clumps of hair and rags. At least that's all we found find in the morning. We've even heard talk of that there's some kind of giant rat rat god that tells tells him what all what to do. Yeah, this is getting a lot more serious. I thought it was initially just a pest problem, but the people are being killed. This is, I think, this is serious, serious enough that we want to investigate it. Okay, what about the cars? We have a whole lot full of cars, all ready, ready for their owners to come back from shopping. Thing is, they never did. Not a dang one of them runs, though. There's a real beauty of a Chrysalis Motors Highwayman just eat fear, but I haven't figured out how to get to it yet. Okay, okay, thanks all I need to know. Goodbye.